हाय एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल लर्न कॉमर्स विथ नमिता आई एम नमिता माने इन टूडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व एन एग्जांपल ऑफ इनकम फ्रॉम बिजनेस दिस एग्जांपल वाज आस्ड इन एस एग्जामिनेशन क्लास टी वाई सब्जेक्ट टैक्सेशन इन द ईयर एप्रिल ट्वेंटी द मार्क्स फॉर दिस एग्जाम्पल इज सेवन मार्क्स so the example is on the screen following is the profit and loss account for the business of mr ram solapur for the financial year ending on 31st march 2024 this is the profit and loss account of the business of mr ram so to the debit side salary is given 120000 interest on loan is given Forty-one thousand five hundred, advertisement six thousand five hundred, fire insurance five thousand, office expenses thirty-six thousand, then depreciation fifty thousand, net profit one lakh twenty-eight thousand, then to the credit side, gross profit three lakh twenty-five thousand, then gift from friend. Forty-four thousand. Then sundry receipts, eighteen thousand, and the total is three lakh eighty-seven thousand. Now, along with this profit and loss account, there are some additional information given. Other information: the bank loan is taken for business purpose. Then depreciation is allowed as per income tax rule, rupees forty-five thousand. okay then advertisement includes includes 2500 as expenses for selling household furniture salary includes rupees 10500 paid for domestic purpose that is personal use you are required to compute taxable income from business for assessment year 24 25 under old regime okay now to compute the income from business first of all you have to prepare this format okay now in income from business we have to take first net profit in that net profit we have to add disallowed expenses now what is this disallowed expenses disallowed expenses are those expenses which are not the part of the business those expenses you are going to add and less the income disallowed but credited to balance sheet okay to the sorry to the pnl account so income which is not related to the business and still it is showing in the profit and loss account that we have to less okay so from this particulars we have to identify which expenses are allowed which expenses are not part of the business that we are going to add okay so disallowed expenses will be in the debit side of the profit and loss account and income disallowed will be in the credit side okay disallowed expenses i will repeat again disallowed expenses are those in expenses which are not the part of the business that means the expenses which are done for the personal benefit or personal use so those expenses you are going to allow you are going to add and income means the ex income which is not the part of the business that we have to do that is to be less okay now see your salary salary is 1 lakh rupees now in the uh, salary here there is the other information okay now 1 lakh 20000 is the salary which is used for the business but here 10500 is used for what domestic purpose means what for the personal use okay so that this 10500 will be what disallowed expenses clear now first you will write the net profit as per pnl account how much is the net profit 1 lakh 28000 so right 1 lakh 28000 
ओके फ्रॉम दिस नेट प्रॉफिट एट दी डिसउड एक्सपेन्सेस नॉ सैलरी वन लैक ट्वेंटी थाउजंड इज अ पार्ट ऑफ यू बिजनेस बट फ्रॉम दैट टेन थाउजंड फाइव हंड्रेड इज वॉट पेड फॉर दी डोमेस्टिक पर्पज सो दिस टेन थाउजंड फाइव हंड्रेड इज वॉट डिसउड एक्सपेन्सेस दिस इज यूज फॉर दी पर्सनल यूज सैलरी डोमेस्टिक पर्पज how much is the uh, salary for, which is used for domestic purpose 10500 okay next interest on loan 41500 now see here whatever is the loan taken it is used for what business purpose so this is not disallowed expenses now next is advertisement advertisement is rupees how much 6500 now see here there is the adjustment what they have said advertisement includes what 2500 as expenses for selling household furniture household furniture means personal furniture to uh, to sell the personal furniture household okay household for house purpose whatever furniture is there to sell that furniture the expenses is how much for that advertisement 2500 so this is what not related to the business it is done for the personal benefit so right advertisement advertisement household expenses rupees 2000 Five hundred. Okay. Next, fire insurance five thousand. Fire insurance is a part of the business. Okay. So that is not disallowed expenses. Office expenses rupees th uh, thirty six thousand. Uh, office expenses is also used for the business. That is not to be taken for the uh, computation of income from business. Then depreciation. Fifty thousand. Now here, as per income tax rule, depreciation is allowed. How much? Forty five thousand. Okay, but actual depreciation is how much? Fifty thousand. That means five thousand is excess. Okay, it is used excess. So depreciation, excess depreciation. Fifty thousand. Less forty five thousand is allowed by income tax rule. Uh, income tax rule. So excess means extra is how much five thousand. So this is a disallowed expenses. And next net profit we have taken here. So add all these three. What is the total? Eighteen thousand. Okay. Now one lakh twenty eight thousand plus eighteen thousand. What is the total? One lakh forty six thousand. so from 146000 less the income disallowed but credited to pnl account now income disallowed means what the income which is not the part of the business but still it is reflected in the pro, uh, it is reflected in the pnl in the credit side now gross profit part of business gift from friend okay gift from friend is what personal so this is what income which is disallowed okay that we have to less sundry receipt is a part of business so gift from friend rupees 44000 less it from 1 lakh 46000 gift from friend 44000 so 1 lakh Forty six thousand minus forty four thousand remaining is one lakh forty two thousand. So this is a income from business one lakh forty two thousand. Okay, so this is the correct answer for this example number three. I hope you have solved this example in this way, and you have understood today's session. 
that is computation of income from business thank you very much please subscribe my youtube channel like and share the video and do not forget to press the bell bell icon to get the latest notification